Hi there! So this is a really, really quick wig modification tutorial. I figured I'd do this because, um, th these pictures have just been sitting on my laptop and, you know, how that is. I always forget to do my little projects and I'm just clearing space as usual. Um, but this is Gaz from Invader Zim. It's, uh, Yonin Joden Vasquez, I don't know how to pronounce his name, um, cartoon that was on Nickelodeon for a while, a few years back, or well, several, several, several <laughs> years back now. Um, pretty much what you want to do is take your wig. If it's not already the purple color, then I took these um, alcohol-based dyes and I dyed the wig. Um, this was an interesting process because I had to do it multiple times to get the color that I wanted. Um, pretty much I combed it out and I planned where I would be sticking my foam inserts. This is me matching the foam inserts to my face. Now the reason you haven't seen more of this costume is because I did make it a little too short for my head and it looked awkward on me. But the the Technique is not a bad idea, and I plan to be doing something like it in the future for more drastic wigs that um, needed a more um, sharp look to them, because her hair is so gravity-defying that I thought this would be a fun idea. Um, now, as you can see here, I put the foam in, and then I'm just hot-gluing sections of hair to match the foam, completely covering the foam with um, the hair bits. Here you can see the color comparison between my Zelgatis wig, my RLA wig, and my Gaz wig. These projects can be really frustrating because when it's so experimental like this, you want to use the cheapest wig possible. And for, for me, it was I had this extra pink wig laying around, so I dyed it purple and did this experiment. But in hindsight, with my Ashlyn wig and with this wig, it would have been easier for me, and the project would have turned out nicer if I had just used a nicer wig from the get-go. If I hadn't dyed the wig, the materials would have been very simple. It just would have been the same color of foam, the tacky glue and the hot glue. It's a pretty cheap project, but it takes a lot of patience. So for extra reference and tutorials, look at the links below. Have a good day, guys. Bye.